Welcome back. Last up, it's Gifton. Welcome to the show, Gifton. Thank you, Brad. I love it. First person we've had on the show called Gifton. Does it have a meaning? To be honest, I don't think even my mother knows the meaning of it. <laughs> I have no idea where she got it from, but it's quite unique, sir. I enjoy it. <laughs> I like it. I like it. OK, where are you based, mate? I'm in London, uh, in Bow, near in, the Olympic Village. In Bow, yeah, OK, all right. And what do you do for a living? I'm a train driver. Bro. Oh, right, OK. Underground or overground? Underground. Ah, are you really? What's your line? What line? I'm on the central line. You're not? I've been on your train hundreds of times. It's a sensational journey. Yes, when it all goes to plan, but... Yeah, absolutely. That's another thing. Yeah. What do you do in your time off? I love uh, taking in sports, particularly the football, cricket, tennis, anything like that. Cool. And if you were to win some money today, what would you do with it? Well, Brad, my hair is disappearing at an alarming rate. <laughs> so if I was to win some money, I'd hope to get a hair transplant or You're something kidding? along those lines. How much is a hair transplant? Well, it's between five and 6,000, the estimates that I got. Is so it? I don't think my wife would let me spend it on that, but I can live in hope. What's your wife's name? Samantha. All right, gift and I wish you well, mate. Good luck. Here we go. Good time. <sighs> Starts now. In a hit song, Frankie Lyman asks, why do fools fall in what? love? Correct. Mutant expert Moira McTaggart is most associated with what comic book series? X-Men. Correct. Vivid blue and fancy deep blue are classifications of what precious gemstone? Sapphire. Diamond. In Australia, a Darwin stubby is a very large bottle of what drink? Beer. Correct. What San Francisco landmark is said to be the world's most photographed bridge? Golden Gate. Correct. A statue of which folk hero was erected in Altdorf, Switzerland, 1895? William Tell. Correct. How was comedian Terence Allen Milligan better known? Pass. Spike Milligan. What British fashion brand has a logo in the shape of a laurel wreath? Uh, Burberry. Fred Perry. Heather Knight succeeded Charlotte Edwards as England captain in what Cricket. sport? Correct. What surname is shared by jazz age writer F. Scott and jazz singer Bit Ella? Jarring. Correct. Brilliant. Cricket question straight in. <laughs> Bit jammy, that. Well, not sure about that. If you know your cricket, mate, you know your cricket. Uh, all right, Gifton, seven grand. Great. Nah, great performance. That will get me some here. It will. <laughs>